So, guys. Oh, it's been so long, right? So here's the thing. Ezra got him a job at Taco Bell, and he's bringing in enough money to have a little bit of disposable income. I'm a bit twisted right now. For those of you in the know, you'll understand. For those of you who don't know what that means, probably better you didn't. But almost as always, I've been drinking. So, I want to say what is up, guys. I'm really excited about this okay like y'all probably don't understand how big this is for me but this means that I can record videos like this for you guys now so that you can watch me do more entertaining things than just rant and a lot of people um, a lot of people liked my rants they really did a lot of people were like dude that's awesome keep it going and I just sort of lacked the determination and drive and motivation that I needed to uh, continue that series and it's not that I'm killing this series I will do more rants in the future I will but maybe now's not a good time and besides brand new tablet I'm ready to rock and roll and do some games for you guys now I am playing the mobile game or the mobile version of the game Terraria I know a lot of uh, Terraria fans out there will probably not ever find my video but it's the risk I take, isn't it? So, back on schedule here. Let's go ahead and click play. Let's go ahead and do this. I did all this beforehand because the, I love RCA's tablets, but they've got a few kinks. Uh, the RCA Maven Pro and the Viking Pro both have the same thing. I used the Maven on my last videos. Sorry, I thought I heard something. I used a Maven on my last videos, and now I'm using a Viking. But, hmm, that's going to be a bit of an issue. Oh, it's been so long. I forgot where the uh, joystick is, and now my face cam is covering my joystick. So, I have no idea exactly where. Why has this slime got a ribbon on it? Is that, like, part of the uh, Christmas thing but anyway this episode isn't going to be like legitimate gameplay this is mainly to a test how per fuck my speech right now this is mainly to test how Terraria performs and it's also to give you guys information so I do in fact have a little bit of disposable income now I'm doing pretty good I know that uh, I was talking about being in some really bad you know situations with money and whatnot and I, I was and I still am and I probably will be for a long time uh, but now that I'm starting to get a little bit of cash for my job and sorting things out things are looking up things are looking up great for me so I don't want you guys to feel bad about me when I told everybody you know that I was real bad down in the dumps and whatnot. That wasn't to get pity or anything like that. That was mainly to just figure out where I stand. And I forgot how I do this. Do I click on the chests? No. Oh, I know how to do it. I know how to do it. Whew. Almost forgot. It's been a while. Oh, I can quickly up stack and down stack now, which is pretty epic. Uh, yeah, we'll take that. Anyway, I'm really, really excited to be doing videos for you guys again. And if Terraria does well and people want to see me play Terraria, we'll do Terraria. I will make a series out of Terraria, period. And this is, in fact, going to be the first video. Whether or not I continue that series until some seemingly endless uh, finality, that's yet to be seen. I don't know whether... There will be a, a certain end to the Terraria series. It may just be an ongoing series. Or I might discontinue it at any point. I don't know. But I mainly wanted to give you guys information on this video. And to see how Terraria is going to perform. I also have a game called Dungeon Quest. That I would really like to play for you guys. Dungeon Quest. I don't know how well known it is. But they have their own forums and everything. Dedicated to it. It's a, a pretty big game in its own right. 
and it's not like it's a big game because it's so good or anything or so popular. It's it is a good game, but it's a big game because people like it. It's not they don't really look at it as a good or bad game. You're talking about people who love the game because they love the game. They like it because of what the game is. Holy shit, where did I get a bug net from? That's not bad gear. That's pretty uh pretty lucky I'd say. You know what? I need to be taking these chests. Yeah, give me that chest. But yeah, um I'm so happy to actually be able to do this for you guys. I'm so excited right now. Um I know a lot of people are probably like, what is this moron talking about? I'm talking about the fact that I could not do these. Why is it not working? I forgot I got to sit here and actually hold on the chest and it's still not working. I can't break these blocks until I break the chest, but it's... Did I put something in this chest? Is that... It won't let me break the chest if something is in it? I don't know, that sort of seems new. Huh. Interesting. I thought it was sort of like Minecraft and just sort of exploded happiness upon you when you broke chests with things in them. Anyway, back to what I was saying. I'm really excited to be able to do these videos for you guys because I enjoy doing them. I can experience a much higher motivation and resolve to do these videos for you guys when I enjoy making them. The mini rants I enjoy making, I really do, but it's really hard for me to find topics to speak on, especially topics that aren't going to raise a certain level of holy shit controversy. And, uh, you know, it's hard. It's really hard as a YouTuber to figure out what kind of content you want to upload and if everyone's going to be okay with your content. It's a constant inner struggle. And, uh... I'm gonna swap over and hold this glow stick and go down. Holy shit, did not mean to throw glow sticks. It's been so long since I played this game. Uh, this looks so well carved out. This is almost... I'm about to die. I know I'm about to die. It's okay. Oh god. If I am gonna die, I at least don't want to fucking drown. But... It's really hard for me to decide like what kind of content I want to make for you guys because I don't want to upset anybody. And I know a lot of people are like, "Aha, oh, ha, he's a pussy. He's pussy fighting around. He's just stepping on eggshells." And I am. I really am. Cuz I like all the people who can enjoy my videos. I've said it before and I'll say it again. You never really know who out there just has had the crappiest day. They might be thinking you know, nobody likes me, or uh, they might be thinking that they don't have any friends, they might be thinking that their life just is meaningless and doesn't mean anything to them or to anyone else. And I want those type of people out there to come and look on YouTube and find somebody like me, and if one of those people finds my videos hilarious or at least noteworthy, that could change their entire day around. I could change how they feel about themselves. And that's why I have the utmost respect for YouTubers who put content out that makes you smile and makes you just enjoy yourself and you know your life. Even if you're living day to day just to watch that YouTuber, at least you're still living. So I respect those YouTubers out there. Anyone who makes content, I have such a high respect for you. Anyway. Wow. Goodbye, Glow Stick. Anyway. Anyway, so, basically, keep making content, YouTubers, and that's why it's so hard for me to choose content, because I want it to be something that'll make people happy. I want it to be something that could potentially make somebody's day better. I don't want it to be something that's going to upset someone even worse than they already are. So, I think that the gaming series is much better a choice than the mini rant series, I'm probably going to work on this for a little while just so that I can really get the idea of what I'm doing and what's going Ooh, hello slime. Ah. Ah, you're killing me. Dude, this slime is murdering me right now. Okay, we're going to equip the sword. 
just for shits and giggles. Ooh. Ooh. Why is there just a chest in the middle of this puddle? Oh. My. God. Extra defense boost. Cloud in a bottle. First golden chest. We find. First try? I mean, can you get much better than that? Oh, I know a few YouTubers who would be jealous right now. We are going to upstack all of that. Yes, sir. -y. Let's go over here. Wait, do I have to equip it from here? I bet I do. So, I got gel. No one really needs. And three spelunker potions. Seven shine potions. Man, we're doing pretty good on potions already, too. This is. This is beautiful. Okay. Did it automatically equip those? Yes, yes, it did. Okay. So, I can now double jump. Should be handy for me if I can stay alive, or if up oh, I wasted the double jump, but it's okay. <gasps> and the slime statue. Oh my goodness, there are people who would be so jealous of me right now. So jealous of me right now, and I got a skeleton statue as well. No, I learned my lesson last time. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, now the yellow slime can't get to me at all. Ugh. 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 Yeah, whiffed them. Anyway, I love playing these games for you guys. That's one of the. Is that platinum? <laughs> I'm just. I'm getting distracted. Every few minutes, I'm just like, hello? Oh, it is platinum. A platinum pickaxe would be wonderful. Thank you. Thank you, platinum. I wonder if this is enough platinum to do a platinum pickaxe. Surely it is, right? I will definitely do a platinum pickaxe. That sounds amazing. I used to do about 30 minute videos, and I don't know if I'm going to continue in that um, habit or method, if you will. I don't know if, I, if I'm going to do that. But if I do, I think Terraria would be a great game for 30 minute videos. I don't know about you guys. Leave a comment down below what you guys think. I really, really am curious as to, you know, who all thinks Terraria is a good choice? Who thinks that Terraria is a bad choice? Who thinks that I'm never going to get good views or respect for playing Terraria? Just, if you've got anything to comment, just leave it down in the comments, guys. I will respond to everything respectful that I can possibly respond to as quickly as I can. I love seeing you guys comments. It's uh, It lets me know that there are people watching and I really do appreciate any comments that are left in it. And do I spy with my little eye? Oh, it's a bomb statue. I don't know anything about bomb statues. I know a little bit about slime statues, but not really a lot about bomb statues. So, that's a little sketchy for me. I don't know how I feel about bomb statues. But, we have gotten our first and second life crystals. So, I think in just a moment I'm gonna do a little bit more exploration I don't think I can mine the crim ore yet but seeing as there is in fact crim that would no I think I discovered last time that it can be either one so I don't know if there's crimson in our, our world or if it's uh, what's the other one I don't know if it's corruption or crimson. So, is this platinum? Yes, it is. Um, as for a build on this character, I'm not on quote unquote expert mode. I don't even think that the mobile version of Terraria has expert mode. So, I've never actually beaten this game in regular mode. I've, I'm sort of a, a noob at Terraria. I'm not the best person to play this game. So with that being said, I 
am going to allow myself to drown right here and it's going to take me back to my spawn point with all this awesome gear I know a lot of you are like no don't do that I know I, I understand but I've got no money right now I'm not going to lose a lot so I'm not the best at Terraria but I know a few things about it and I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here we're going to start right back at our, our spawn point next time we play and thank you guys so much for watching. Um, as always, guys, I hope you all dream in neon. And if you like this video, remember to hit that like button for me. Share it. Show your friends. Uh, leave some comments. I love reading comments. And I'm so happy to be back for you guys. So happy to be back. This was money well spent. The RCA Viking Pro. Hundred dollars, one oh seven. It was for me, tax and all at Walmart. Go pick you up one. They're actually pretty nice tablets. I gotta say. Does that have a USB port? Yeah, it's got a USB port. I mean, they're pretty nice tablets for a hundred bucks. As far as budget tablets go, ten inch screen, USB port, micro HDMI. It's got it all. Micro SD card slot. But I'm going to go ahead and end the video, guys, and I will see you in the next episode of Terraria. Peace out.